Hello, and welcome back to the B to the 7 Quick Bits. Today I want to spend a little bit more time talking about LinkedIn. LinkedIn is one of those important tools in your job search. This is something that needs to be kept up to date. It is a reference for people to come and see, but more importantly, it is a reflection of your career, what you've been doing, and even your personal brand. So let's dig into LinkedIn and your profile and what it is that you need to do to update it so that it's more appealing and attractive for potential recruiters and employers. Why is LinkedIn important? Great question. Many employers will use LinkedIn to research your employment history, your past accomplishments, the way you post, who you're engaging with to get a better understanding of who you are, not only as a person, but also as a potential employee for their brand. It is also you know, great for the brand itself, but it's also great for building your personal brand. So let's dig into the tips that we have to get you going with uh, LinkedIn. Tip one, let's start with a professional profile photo and a relevant background image and or photo. Remember, you wanna come across as very professional, so choose a photo that represents you as a career person, not you out in the backyard playing or you at the swimming pool. Keep it professional, keep it classy, and keep it being something that if they saw you on a the street, they would recognize who you are. Tip two, write an engaging and comprehensive profile headline. This is what people will see in their search and is also one of the first things someone will see when they come to your profile outside of your picture. Tip three, utilize the about section to really emphasize the key accomplishments that you have. Great place to go a little bit more into detail of what your past history is, what you can bring to the table, but a great place to utilize this information. Tip number four, one area that is not utilized very often or very much within LinkedIn is the featured area. Use this, this area to highlight past posts, um, past updates, articles, you can even, um, attach documents and or files to this. It's a great way to showcase some of the things that you have done, accomplishments, your resume, utilize this area. It's a great place to um, stand out within your profile. Tip number five, these are your listed experiences. Keep this consistent with what you have within your resume, but the opportunity with LinkedIn is you can go into a little bit more detail. Tip number six, the skills and endorsement section. Think of this as um, where recruiters can see your core competencies. Tip number seven, recommendations. You can talk about yourself all day long, but just think of how important and how powerful a recommendation from a coworker is or a boss is. Reach out to those connections, get those individuals to come back to LinkedIn, write recommendations for you so that, so that when someone comes to your site, they can see how other people feel about your work, how other people feel about you. Very important part of the LinkedIn profile. Tip eight, use the accomplishments section to highlight any projects that you've contributed to or worked on. Tip nine, include any causes and or volunteer work that you've done. Great way to highlight what you do in the community. Action items for you today. LinkedIn is your professional profile, so do keep it professional. As you're going through the tips today, if you have any questions, please reach out. They are pretty easy to set up to update within your profile. Like I said, any questions, send me a DM. I will help you as best as possible. And if you have other career questions and or looking for jobs or careers, go visit careerbarn.com. You all have a great, great, great day and talk to you later.